Hey everybody. I wasn't gonna do one more, but I'm gonna do one more. Uh, you're probably seeing these all in order, or maybe not, but uh, this is Riggs Max Cat. <clears throat> right, Riggs Max Cat. Let's check the codex. As I had said, like, Riggs Books Cat. Oh, we already did Max Cat. Max is just such a strong pilot, you can annihilate your whole deck and just play all your good cards. Like this. No Max. We played it. I played a ton of Max in the, like, original playthrough and this is all just the cleanup of the rest of the logbook let's get started do a type sure max xe a Ooh, draw shot a more cards okay speaking of like crazy max cards there's my whole deck now what do i do <laughs> Probably play the Dizzy card. Let's see what's in here. Block. We can draw back. Draw back. <clears throat> ah, just move out of the way. We can keep shooting, right? Use Mage Hand every time it's up, because it's more damage than the other ones. Uh, let's just do this and move out of the way. The next time they shoot, though, they uh, will be shooting for uh, damage that damages our hull, but I don't think we get there. This is flippable. Hmm. It's not as good as Fleet Footed. Fleet Foot is also not damage, which is awkward. Uh, and I think we'll try to find cards here. Brimford. Smuggling work, sure. Ricochet Paddle is awful. Oh, here's the thing for the... <laughs> that would have been funny if we had two of these fights in a row. Uh, so here. This gets out of the way. We still block one. We can shard and shoot. Just blocks again. Mage Hand being such a versatile card. Momentum. Memory Leak. Yeah, I guess. Just keep shooting. Like, what if I take the Memory Leak out? And the Dodge out? And this basic shot out? We'll get hit for a little bit, but we're going to need to try to finish this fight at some point. Momentum blocks is fine, right? Save my evasion. Fight's pretty hard because we did not find good, um, good damage. It's not that it's hard, it's that it's going poorly. The same. Let's shoot here and do more damage. Take the one extra evasion. We have fully stabilized though, so. We just don't have a lot of damage. It's a low damage attack right now. Especially depending on the cards we pull. More fleet footed? Okay. I'm just gonna be moving around. Oh, this is awkward. Sure. We shoot them, they shoot back. What's in the dizzy card? The stun shot. They'll still shoot back though. Sunshot is deceiving like that. They'll still shoot back. Yeah, that seems fine. Crystal shard? Hmm. 
Oh, hey. Draw a card. Thing. Oh, they didn't have the buff. That's good for us. Bob Moose leaves the deck, so that's nice. Basic cards to do one more. Okay. We saw both of them, so. This other one's being unplayable. Oh, Drake. What's the Dizzy card? Oh, Corrosion Beam. Oh, well. That's pretty good. Um, I am going to actually use this Fleet Footed to get away first. We can just take it the long fight as we eventually roll back around to it. Plus three, not four. And the other ones are literal trash. Stack up our defenses a little. We'll be here a minute. I love about this game that you can take the fights really slow if you want to. As if you're flying around, they're chasing you, you're chasing them, double fleet footed. Doing work. Like, first fleet footed good, second fleet footed even better. We will just waddle around this whole battlefield. Holy wait, five more turns. It won't be five more turns. It's like this is happening. The acid happens at the end. Move out of the way. Interesting dizzy card. Avid reader. No, it's really bad. Catch also really bad. At least it goes away. I don't know that I've picked catch before, but it just is a good amount of block. It's really good for setup. Two geodes, terrible. Calibrator, great. Whenever you have no cards, draw. Or sharp edges. I think sharp edges, because if we can like get our deck to small, we just do that. Play that to start. Lazy Barrage, probably not. I can take the sharp edge as well too, because fleet footed will help us like just do hull damage, because like I just need to get to the end of our deck twice right now. Um and then we're good. Our second fleet footed is here. I think we just do this. We like keep ending, press end turn, and then every time we roll over the deck, we're good. Oh. That was the wrong way, Von Moose. There you go, like that. If in the meantime, like this works out, like that's fine too. We also have fairly easy ways to run away. Block evolution. We don't make a lot of crystal shards. We also don't block. Our only block card are these two cards. Now we'll just run away, it's fine. Moose. Go.
Oh, I guess we should buy the Aegis back. Well, this feels fine. Draw three feels good. Should probably be playing that every time so we get through our decks. We can have Sharp Edges do things for us. Dizzy. Okay. Yo, sharp edges, thank you. Really strong artifact. Well, is fine to help set up. Remove a card, upgrade a card. I think we want to upgrade the basic shot, actually. Which is weird. Leaf B is also incredible. Lose this at the end of your turn, so you lose all of it. I think it causes zero. I think it's cost zero. This is like a bunch of our damage. What's the dizzy card? Deflection. Converter. Any amount of shields gets converted into dodge. Probably not. The max card? Root access memory leak. Sure. Why not? Oh, moose. Moose in it. Uh, this is like block and some other things, so we can move one. Draw more to do more damage and get back to our basic shot. We can draw more cards and other things, so. This is four damage, so we can just like fleet foot like this. Bye! Once they have the homing missiles, it's really easy to get away. We do plenty of damage, and the... Um, the sharp edges have done like 7 or 8 damage. Wish the damage was tracked on this, right? This is terrible. Cat card in the pile. Zero doubler. Warp mastery. This helps us set up, but zero doubler is like more, way more interesting. Main cards cost zero and then you double it. Ooh, boy. That's fun. Probably start here, so we can do this. So we can draw two. Uh, cloud save. Put Bolt back in. Also, since we have a zero cost of two attack, it does four. Like, that's kind of nutty. Play Vamos. Cicada can keep powering up. I don't care. We have plenty of power. Vamos. I wonder if you can fly far enough away that they're like off the screen and you leave the encounter. Is that a thing? Jack of all trades B. No. Absolutely not. Now or never? Also absolutely not. Double elite here. Okay, we'll go to the middle here. We can just block for one. Honestly, the dizzy card. Momentum's fine, gets us started. Get to double draw here and see what's in the deck. And we just get to shoot. Yep. Yep. I gotta go, I'll be over here. Your missiles fire very slowly, sir. Decks that can't move very well. This fight can be incredibly scary. Worm security system. Oh, it plays twice. Oh, interesting. Play this. Give you retain. Forgot that books played twice. Okay. 
goodbye missiles and goodbye star dog. Oh, Aegis didn't get played. We're gonna shuffle our deck before we play Aegis. That's okay. Oh, we could have like turned these back at them too. Let's see if we can find Aegis. Oh, we shuffle our deck. No, sharp edges. Why? Mining drill. Those cost zero. Also, no thanks. What, Sasha, why are you here? It's like four runs in a row, you're here. Uh, I do want an artifact. Does shuffling our deck actually give us, kick us out of this game? It'd be really interesting. Because we're going to shuffle our deck and damage our opponent with sharp edges. Like, how does that work? Uh, sure. Uh, sure. Oh. Forgot that we were getting given ace to start here. Yep. But the game is over. This is a weird. Uh, I want a trophy, please. Every time your discard pile is shuffled. Shard collector. Yeah. Give me the rig stuff. What are salutations? Do they say, like, draw a card? Do any of these say, like, ditch the card? Fleet foot to zero, gets to be played twice. Could be really good. I think I just upgrade basic shot. It's kind of weird. They do double damage, so this means they also get played twice like this. I think we just moose. Best thing about Vamoose is that it just gets you away and allows you to set up in more interesting ways. Alt. Come on down, bud. You're firing missiles that don't mean anything because we can move. We move so far. Play this twice. Your system's fine. Half max is fine. Worm is god awful. I'm to shoot them first rather than play that first, but that's okay. Whoa. Let's shuffle the deck. I also didn't answer my question on the. not answer my question on like if we sh if sharp edges like hurts the opponent okay bye now my basic shots do four because books like it seems kind of nuts quick thinking can be upgraded in cool ways and do cool things this one, Resonance Fork, fill your shard at the start, cockpit lock on. Okay, we'll take the lock on. Not a lot of things have cockpits, which is one of the problems, just like this uh, one here. That's okay. Mathmax, cloud save. Mathmax, cloud save. Huh. That's what I mean by try to find something good. This will just give us um, evasion, but you know, whatever. Oh, it'll give us heat. Oh, that's right. That's a status. That's fun. Dizzy card. Stun shot. Okay. Perfect. We'll take some haul here. That's really funny though. Just give me double that. Let me let me double down on some of that. Double fleet footed. Oh, it's so nice. Uh sure. Gunshot. Age. 
Go next. Shuffle my deck. Uh, Aegis, so we keep stacking it. That's a card that could let you survive a shot from Cleo, maybe. I don't know that we have a Cleo killing deck, though, or will. Oh, how did it be? It's a kitty baby. Two cards, sure. Love cards. Start here. Clean exhaust. Okay. These cards that we get from this opponent will exhaust cleanly. Oh, this one. <laughs> it was played twice because it costs zero. Um. We'll just EMP. It's fine. Oh, Aegis. <laughs> 16 temp shield. Hilarious. What now? <laughs> just take the shot. Uh, I have plenty of move, right? Right, Copium? We'll just move four. And Abyssal Visions causes zero. Sick. This is a block five? Okay. Guess we just block five. I don't know that I want any of this. Perpetual motion. Whenever you have no cards, draw a card. Ooh. Yeah. Yeah, I do want. Now, I want to remove shit out of my deck. Like, you know, literal trash. What is literal trash and it's why is it scramble? This thing's really bad. Like, I have played it, but it's real bad. Why? Oh, this is considered the cockpit. So they have double weak. I didn't realize Rig's cockpit was directly in the middle. Interesting. Learning. Still learning. Max. Admin deploy. Oh my god. Cloud save. Bring back the Aegis. Moose. Aegis. Draw some cards. Turn off these. That Aegis is stacked so hugely. Oh my god. How about Fleet Footed, but Mage Hand goes away? Ziff. Because now that we have Admin Deploy, we can get our deck down to zero. Dizzy. You're terrible. Admin deploy. I think we actually play fleet footed and like kind of book it. Just a little bit. We could have probably booked it one more to make them uh, chase us really hard. But you know. Uh, quick thinking. Admin deploy. I'll never make my deck tiny enough. Oh, oh, well, I was still playing. Evil rigs get back. I was playing cards still. AI overflow. Draw every cat card in the draw pile. I guess it goes away too. Flywheel. I love flywheel. Can generate energy for us to like continue to get through the deck as we draw cards and draw cards and draw cards and draw cards. Speaking of our draw pile, hello draw pile. We're gonna play Aegis, so we're just gonna shoot for 
everything here. Okay. What's the dizzy card? Boost capacitors, I guess. And then just run away. Look at us go. Vamos. Go next. The Cicada MK3 does have a lot more hit points than everything else. But that's okay. Because we have this strategy called just run away. Um, like this. I didn't max out the sharp edges, but it does it, it does keep contributing. There you go, thanks sharp edges. Quick thinking A. I love that. I love I love all this. We have all the rigs. Sweet artifacts. Uh this gives us an extra shop. Brimford. Got nothing that time on my hands. You gave us the rick the paddle, the ricochet? Quick thinking could go to the other one. Draw shot A? Nope. Max A could go to the other one. Seems fine. Move the max A over and move quick thinking A over. A to B. I want three cards for max. A to B. I want this one to go A to B. No thanks. Thank you. We now made our deck worse, but. We can get it out of here. I also don't want the card that you're giving me. Max, what do you got? I'll just reroute, my man. Uh, yeah, that. Oh good, we'll draw every cat card. That's why that card is really bad. If it shows up in the beginning, it's not so bad, but... Oh boy. It's not good. Uh... I think we just go about killing them. I'm good. Thanks, books and cat. Quick thinking A. No. Max, can you be good, please? Cloud save. I mean, I guess. Max, can you be good, please? Admin deploy. Cloud save. Max, can you be good? I feel like I'm in a loop. Cloud save. I'm in a loop. See, that's what I'm saying, where the cards can just be hot trash from these .exes. They need to be even one more card. Four cards when upgraded, three cards base. Two cards base is really, really bad. Um, there's two cockpits on here, which is really nice to have that weakness. So we will just do this. Sweet. We just get to the other side of the field. <laughs> Uh, the six vamoose the other way. Yep. Cool. And they come all the way over here. 
so much damage. Ridiculous. I'm good. Yeah, I'm good. Grazer Beam. This is uh, our infinite. Or a form of an infinite. Goodbye. Overclock generator. Overcharger. Let's take the overcharger. The thing here is start here. Grab a shot here. This. Do this. It's a zero cost attack. There isn't any. Well, we want to play the Aegis anyways. You do have to fill your hands with all of your cards. Oh no, we're locked in place. No, what will I do? Guess I'll just like hang out. Guess we'll just hang out here and do this. Yeah? Don't quite have like Guess I'll just hang out here and keep shooting you. Oh no, not that. I have one too many cards in my deck, I feel. We could get rid of Aegis and some other things like this and then Overflow. And then Dizzy gives me a card that does something like this that goes away and Max gives me a card that goes away. Sure. I feel like I can wait. Just let them shoot, and then we can stun them now. Like this. Oh no, they get a power drive. They're gonna be more powerful. No. Three this way. Puts me on the side here, and we still do one. And then quick draw for three, right? And our infinite's here. Look at that. It's slow, but it's infinite. It won't let me click the second card. It waits until the animation is done. Nice shot, I think. Yeah, thanks, books. Ah, it's beautiful. Bamus A costs less. All right, sure. Gets out of my deck too. Meowdy, not in front of everyone, please. Upgrade a card. Basic dodge. Oh, gets it out of the deck? It's the same. For some reason, I thought it just upgraded it to two, but it upgrades it to ditching it out of your deck, which is great. Uh, this is great. Aegis, quick thinking. Uh, basic dodge, max, what do you got? Admin deploy? No. At least it stays in my hand, right? We still have Vamoose and other things to play. We can just sit here and take hits. AI overflow, thank you. What's the dizzy card? Button mash is great. This is great. Play this card. And now we should have enough card draw and other things. And if we have enough setup from the flywheel, we should be okay, right? Uh, this one. Trash is getting put into our deck every other turn, so that's awkward, but we should be able to go off because we'll move three. Then we only need to move one and sit here. Right? Calibrator's kicking in. It's working. We'll be here a moment, y'all. It's a pretty slow infinite. But uh, that's the game. This is the way I found this. Uh, I found this earlier in this type of playthrough. I, maybe I realized it before, but like 
the having getting a recalibrator and grazing shot is incredible the incredible power if you can fill your hand and you can have a zero cost you just get to go infinite Let's play through this. We'll be done here in a minute. Just fill your cost with uh, fill your hand with cards that cost zero and are hits and things like Vamus and exhaust all the cards in your deck. You're good to go. It's a slow one, but it's a win, that's for sure. When I go and play on hardest, like I'm probably gonna play on hardest at some point. I'd probably play Riggs, Max, Books, because you can have this type of infinite a lot easier with that team. Maybe it's like not enough damage, right? Not sure. Having the two, da two damage uh, basic shots and Books firing them twice into enemies was very strong early. Continue. 35 minutes, not bad. Combat turns, 114. That seems high. Um, what a great game. This one turned out very nicely, uh, even with basic shot A's. Because uh, early on we took uh, initial booster so that the basic cards do more damage. With Cat on the team, you can get uh, trinkets that are very good, but then again, you just take all of the Riggs trinkets. And even this trinket from um, Books is zero doubler. I think I got offered a Riggs trinket that I turned down. Um, this one's very good too. She's got more card draw. You can choose to shoot twice. Uh, so you can get six damage out of one basic shot A if you hit it on the cockpit with our, what was this? Cockpit lock on makes it weak. Anyways, that was the run. Thanks so much for uh, watching, and if you like the content, go ahead and subscribe, and we'll see you next time.